Hello guys, welcome to my 17th tutorial on XHTML and CSS. So in this video I will teach you how to change uh, some uh, list properties or changing some styles and changing the style of the list. Okay, so let's do some simple lists on our Notepad++. You can delete all the code from the last uh, video tutorial. Okay. This table. Okay. So let's do. Let's start by doing uh, the unordered list with the UL tag, which stands. It stands for unordered list, as you should know already. And now we just put we're going to place some content in our list okay with some words let's make a list of only three items let's type item one item two and item three okay save it let's open this and uh, Chrome or Firefox, whatever you are using, and there it is. Item one, item two, item three. Okay, I want to change the style, and the first thing I want to change is this dots right here. Okay, so I don't want my list to have these black dots. Okay, I want another type of dots. Okay, first let's uh, select UL, an ordered list selector, and then let's change the style. You have to type list style, type, and then type this circle. Save it. Let's go to the browser, refresh and now you have instead of black dots you have a white or transparent dots okay let's use uh, another style you can use a square save it and now you'll have squares okay instead of uh, dots uh, at the beginning of each word of the list, okay? Now, uh, if you have um, if you have any uh, image file that you want to use, you can type this uh, list style image, and then URL parenthesis inside the parenthesis you have to type uh, as we did some as as we do with uh, images it load the images to our web page uh, so we do the same using URL and then parentheses and inside we have to type the name of the image file so when we type the name of the image file as long as the image file uh, is in the same directory as the ph1 page one dot uh, html we type it and um well i can use i can use uh let's use the yo bnp this one here uh, and then you'll see the result let's type yo dot bmp bmp now refresh and as you can see this the um, the image loaded okay for uh, at the beginning of each word so instead of points we can use the image we want okay 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 let's give it a let's give it a border now to our list we can also give it a border border one pixel wide size a solid and let's give it a red save it save refresh and there it is okay
Okay, we can also um, instead of using dots or uh, squares or whatever, I don't want anything. So we have to type list list style type none okay we type the word none I don't want any style uh, list type let's refresh and there it is you only have the um, the words and we have no dots or squares or uh, whatever okay uh, let's change of subject and I'll show you now how to use um, two selectors at once okay with uh, we will give uh, the same properties or attributes to uh, uh, more than one selector okay at once okay um, let's give a uh, high uh, sorry a header one let's close it let's give a hello and let's give a paragraph here hi my name is okay let's save this uh, let's save this okay um, let's um, let's imagine then that uh, let me see uh, give it a good example okay so I want the same property for example uh, size I want the size of hello um, no size is not I want the same color of hello and um, hi my name is to be the same okay then we could have here uh, some h2 blah 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 balba 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 whatever that means okay and another word here and whatever okay okay so we now have um, we now have a lot of content in our web page let's refresh this okay we have all this content in our web page but now how can I choose uh, to change the color we learned to change the color of all at the same time okay or choose one um one selector for this another selector for this and another for this uh, so this is very simple if you want to change hello to yellow and hi my name is to yellow you know that you have to change choose the h1 selector curly braces color yellow let's refresh okay so hello now is yellow now I want hi my name is to be yellow also so instead of typing again um, another selector for that that should be it should be P for this paragraph and then color yellow instead of doing this okay uh, we can delete this and after h1 a comma we type comma and then a p okay and let's save this let's open this and now these two are um, in yellow okay so this is just to remember you or uh, teach you that we can use um, we can use uh, more than one uh, selector okay in the same uh, to type the same attributes okay so we could also uh, type here this h2 
okay h2 will have now color yellow also sorry here there it is h2 okay so this will come um, very handy for for uh, instead of changing uh, and doing uh, a new line of code in CSS for attribute yellow and then we have to type again another selector for attribute yellow and another selector for attribute yellow so we can uh, use uh, the select the three or four selectors or um, as many as you want in the same line to use the same uh, attributes okay okay now let's uh, you now uh, know how to change a whole phrase or text uh, inside uh, p tags or h1 tags or whatever and then use a, a CSS code with the um, the um, those uh, selectors and change his color or size or whatever what about if I have this uh, phrase here and I want to change only this word okay I ha I want to change only the uh, size of name or the color okay so let's change the size and the color for word name inside the P um, the p tags the paragraph tags so we would have to write this uh, this uh, tag right here span and after name just after name we close span okay so inside or, or between span tags we leave the name the word that we want to change and in here we use span Okay, and inside, let's change the font size to 20 pixels. And of course, we said we would change the color also. Color blue. Let's save this. Let's refresh it. And there it is. Okay, we have changed only a word. Okay. And we can do this uh, with a word or a letter. If we want uh, to change a letter instead um, of name, we want to change only the N uh, letter. Okay. Uh, sorry. It should be. Okay. So N will appear with, with these uh, two uh, attributes. Okay. Let's see if it works. And there it is. Okay, only n because n is the only thing that um, that is between uh, the span tags. Okay. Um, okay, guys, this is all for this video. And uh, if you have any questions or uh, any doubts, just send me a message, and I'll try to answer them uh, as soon as possible. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel and see you guys in the next video. Bye.